Now, a large community in Vacaville is demanding the property owner take action after a fourth day without electricity. Power went off on Friday at the El Matador Mobile Home Park. And people who live there say they're getting no information from the park owner and little assistance. CBS 13's Kelly Ryan is in Vacaville with what we know on this. Triple digits last week, high in the 90s today, and no air conditioning. Many residents here say they thought they could handle it for a day. But days later, many are calling out the owner for dangerous living conditions. Residents say the park's old and poorly maintained electrical transformer blew, and they blame the owner, Chris Kahabka of LD Flickinger Company, for his lack of maintenance and concern for the safety of residents. The property owner did not return a call, but PG&E tells CBS 13 crews went to check on the situation and found the problem lies with the owner. Park managers are scrambling to keep up with residents' phone calls. The situation is leaving many residents here in dire straits. I live paycheck to paycheck. I don't have the extra income for this. We're just getting the runaround. They're not letting us know nothing. Residents say they've reached out to the mayor and also the city manager, hoping to get some kind of relief and to hold the owner responsible. And Kelly, as park rangers, uh, park managers rather, tell CBS 13 they're providing generators to some of the more vulnerable residents. But because of all the fires, they say there's a shortage mm -hmm. of generators and they're pretty tough to get a hold of right now.